Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. My name is Fish, and today I'm going to talk to you about the six basic functions in trigonometry. I want to make a sign. No, not that kind of sign, silly. Not that kind of sign either. I'll show you what kind of sign I mean by using this giant rocket! I hope that's not a sign of things to come, huh? Do you know what a cosine looks like? Me neither, hold on. I'm dressed as a tiger! I'm gonna do what my teacher usually does and use my hands to explain this. You probably didn't get any of that. Let's try again. This kind of hurts. You know what else we need? Somebody to bond with. No good sir, we need a graph for tangent. And I'm going to make it. Might I inquire how you intend to perform such an intriguing and educationally beneficial venture to individuals interested in recognizing trigonometric concepts? With my yard. I really got a tan by making that tangent. This is where it gets serious. Co-secant. Co-secant is all over the place. What are we going to do? I'll tell you what we're going to do. Rainbow. 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 At least, co-secant isn't as bad as regular secant. Regular secant. Makes me really sad. I can't see secant without making a sad secant face. Yay! So that about wraps up our fantastic elastic basketball festival on Mount Rushmore, but before we open up the field to the fat pigeon mice, I have one more function for you to see. This function is the most fun function of them all. Cotangent. Cotangentleman. I hope you're not planning on using my swimming pool for your presentation. Oh, actually, I had plans to spill oil into your pool and set it on fire. But wait, that's not the end. Do you want to learn how to graph a sine using a sinusoidal function? That wasn't a rhetorical question, people. Raise your hands. I'm just going to assume you raised your hands because I'm a cartoon. Okay. I'm going to do something more absurd than anything else I've done this day. And I'm probably going to regret this. There are few who like seeing sinusoidal equations when you're told to draw them on a graph. If you heed my advice, you won't need to think twice. Every sign problem will just make you laugh. If we look at the problem, keep B, C, A, D in mind, we shall see how we can alter the line. If we just look at B, take the number that we see, we can horizontally stretch out the sign. Now let's look at C, it's as simple as can be. If it's positive, then its X value will go back. Some to the left, I'm sorry if I yelled and made you deaf. Then A we find will make the graph tall. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not singing to the rest of the skies. I'm not. Oh. Hey. D. Credit. I know I can't sing.